what is going on guys so i'm going to talk about you know not worrying about what others think and being authentic uh i actually made a video like this on my old youtube channel like about a year ago but it just popped in my head again because it's still a lesson that i need to learn you know again and again um, when it comes to interacting with people and even uploading to youtube something that holds me back a lot is uh i'm trying to be perfect i'm trying to you know say the right things not stutter you know are people gonna uh like me or something you know so that's just my nature um and something that i'm learning is you know i'm not gonna actually get far if i'm so worried about that because how else am i going to um you know create a, a successful youtube channel without being afraid of uh you know scurring up and stuff so you know it's a uh, it's kind of an obvious thing but it's something that always comes up so if that's you out there and you're worrying about being perfect don't worry about that you know i'm filming with my phone my hair is messy I'm sitting in 100 degree heat not in a perfect environment you know but uh it's all good you know do what you feel uh it's important to you know not only do this when it comes to uploading but uh you know every every day-to-day -day situation you know uh what I'm learning as well is things that make us unique are actually in some ways gifts and not curses because uh, sometimes we may be afraid to socialize and surround ourselves with certain people or people that we don't know because we're afraid that they won't accept us for who we are but maybe that uniqueness that we have that we're afraid of uh, is actually a gift and may actually uplift other people it could be a very unexpected thing that we have you know uh, and of course, there may be people that don't like it. There's going to be people that, uh, you know, talk down on us and like, well, you know, this is, you shouldn't be doing this and, you know, this and that. But our unique gift is, uh, you know, whatever your unique gift is. But the world needs new things. People need new ideas, um, you know. And I'm learning this myself, too, that... You know, being on a uh, on a vegan path, uh, you know, it's my personal choice that I don't want to eat meat. Um, you know, there there are people that understand that. There are people that uh, like that lifestyle, and then there are also people who don't understand it. So what I'm learning is, yeah, I can share my experience with it. Um, you know, and uh, there's going to be people that like it. There's going to people be people that don't. Um, but through this path, I've actually found an alternative way of healing. Um, in my opinion, a more natural way of healing the body. So um, that has been a gift that I've stumbled upon. Um, because in this society, we have a lot of, uh, you know, prescription drugs and surgeries and hospitals and doctors and and medicines and vitamins and you know I'm not saying that doesn't help certain people I'm sure if that's you out there and you've taken pharmaceutical drugs and it's helped you that's that's amazing um, but I'm finding another way of healing um, and this is something that I can see being a gift to not only myself my family but the world as well and people that are open to it um, and I'm still working towards it you know um, but it's something that separates me from the crowd something that makes me different and it scares me to uh, sometimes interact with people because what I'm on is very different and not a lot of people uh, understand it when I explain it to them. So sometimes I find myself better when I'm alone because, uh, you know, it seems more peaceful. But what I'm learning is there are people out there who are open to this type of knowledge and that may be you who you know, who are unaware about raw foods and fasting and stuff. Um, and this this lifestyle is slowly growing. You know, I, I see it increasing on YouTube, social media and stuff. It's not huge. It's not even big, but it's growing. Um, but from what I can tell, the majority of the world doesn't understand, um, you know, this type of stuff, which is okay. So I'm understanding that, you know, I'll be one of the teachers for it. Um, and there's a lot out there as well um, that I've learned from. So... You know, you may have something that is totally different and very unique for you. And uh, 
whatever that may be. And you may be afraid to share that with people uh, because you want to be accepted. And I totally understand that because um, I feel the same way with what I'm doing. So, you know, I guess what we have to learn is there's going to be people that accept it and there may be some that don't. And that's okay. Um, but this uniqueness is going to take us places that we'd never expect because I'm already stumbling upon things that are surprising that I wouldn't think that this path would bring. Um, so for those that are on this raw food path, if you're even watching this, congratulations. <laughs> um, and for those that have their own unique gift that are totally unrelated to the raw foods, um, you may stumble upon things that are very unique and shock you. Um, so I hope this video made sense. Um, But yeah, thanks for watching. Um, it's important to, you know, be authentic with yourself, even if you're not feeling so good. You know, you don't have to be positive all the time. It's all right. Uh, peace.